returning. In the newsroom, I'm Joe Henke, 11 Alive News. Voters pleaded with state officials today to change the state's election system to hand-marked paper ballots. This coming after lawsuits challenging the state's 16-year-old computer voting systems. The state had already set in motion to change that, but to exactly what? 11 Alive's Doug Richards has more on a panel tasked with answering that question. When it makes its recommendation, this voting panel will create a framework for the state to change its election system as early as next year. The question is whether it will eliminate the controversy in doing so. People have lost trust in Georgia's voting system. Many Georgia politicians want a new voting computer system, an updated version of the existing system that's been in place for years. They think voters prefer computers. Many powerful lobbyists also want to sell a pricey new voting system to the state. The gold standard internationally is paper, handmarked paper ballots. However, many tech experts prefer a paper-only system with no computers. They say a paper system can't be hacked the way a computer system can. But computer systems had an advocate in Kathy Cox. She's the last Democrat elected to the Secretary of State's office, and she is sold on computer-aided voting. I think there are new types of technology out there today that could resolve some of the voter uh, issues and give us a more secure election system and a paper trail. The board was urged to act quickly so that the legislature could have a recommendation and a new law in place as a run-up to the 2020 presidential election. In Macon, Doug Richards.